celebration of a rich culture, mm -hmm. celebration of love, yes. and of course, celebration being the chief custodian of the culture and tradition of Ojoto people. All that you will see on the show today. Mm. So while we enjoy it, we can you ask our sensitive viewers to watch out for flash images. Once again, welcome to the program. I'm Oge Chukwosi. And I'm Anne Umawodo. Thank you for joining us on the program today. We begin with the coronation of His Royal Highness Igwe Gerald Mbamalu as the Eze Oranyelu One of Ojoto in Anambra State. Igwe Mbamalu is the third in succession of the traditional rulers in Ojoto, and it was a historic event for the people of the community. So the Metrofile train goes all the way to Anambra State now to witness this beautiful celebration. Sounds of drumbeats are not a traditional instrument at the palace of His Royal Highness Igwe Gerald Mbamalu, a sign that something historic is about to happen. Also significant is the royal entry of the chiefs blowing the elephant tusks. <laughs> The message of the Tusk is clear. It's a royal historic event that will see Ojoto community on the path of unity with the coronation of a new Igwe, the third in the succession of traditional rulers in Ojoto. The Igwe, his wife and their son, drape in royal apparel, step out for the coronation, which will be performed by the custodians of the royal seat of Ojoto. Immediately he steps in, the traditional rite of the coronation begins. He is eventually crowned Igwe Oranyelu, the first of Ojoto. Then the staff of office is presented to him, affirming his authority as the chief custodian of the culture and tradition of Ojoto people. Next is the inauguration of the Igwe in Council, who will support him in the administration of the people. The Igwe then makes his first appearance to the people gathered in his palace. Then the fun fair moves to the arena of the Boy Secondary School Ojoto. Here, an array of dignitaries, traditional rulers, businessmen and women have come up to be part of the history. The new Igwe adds color to the occasion when he arrives in a cart, while his cabinet chief in red and white attire glow and radiate class and royalty. Different dance groups, masquerades and musicians add up to the richness of the grand occasion people have come to pay homage to the new king. I thank God and believe in my God that the responsibility placed on me 
that God will help me to achieve it, to move the town forward, to unite the town, and to bring development to the community. He has to be humble and lead them uh, with love, peace. That is uh, my advice to him. And remain faithful to God, and God will continue to guide him. With this coronation, the new Igwe intends to unite the community, hoping that his reign will bring peace and prosperity to Ojoto.